What's going on, Fire Nation? It's your boy, Amen's back with some new heat for y'all today. First and foremost, shout out to my brother, Lycan. Those of you who don't know, he's in the hospital battling COVID. Actually got some good news this morning of him being able to be released and to come home. He's been getting better. Uh, so thank y'all for the well wishes and prayers and everything. That really meant a lot to him and me just with him being in the hospital and being able to read y'all well wishes, man, that really meant a lot. So thank y'all for taking the time out to post, comment on YouTube, Twitter, DMs, whatever y'all do. Have y'all reached out? Appreciate that for sure. I uh, wish he was here to do this video with me, but once we're able to like meet back with each other and after he's quarantined and all of that, we will definitely get back to doing videos for sure. But yeah, today um, I'm gonna show y'all I went and I had to do it, y'all. I traded in my 2020 Dodge Charger Scat Pack and I got the Dodge Charger 2021 Hellcat Wide Body. You know what I'm saying? And that mug is a beast. I had to do it. I've been thinking about it for a while now. With the chip shortage going on on these cars, the trade-in values like went way up. So I just kind of took advantage of that and was just like, forget it. You know, if I'm gonna upgrade, I might as well upgrade and get the Hellcat. So yeah, I'm about to show y'all. Hope y'all enjoy it. Then we gonna go for a little test drive. And um, yeah, we'll be back. Also too, I recommend, if you're ever thinking about getting a Dodge Charger, like, I recommend getting the scat pack first, getting used to that power, learning how to control that, and then moving up to the Hellcat. Cause the Hellcat is crazy. It's almost scary just getting on the road and stuff and trying to do pools and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I definitely recommend getting the scat pack first. Um, I had the car for about a week now. I need to go and do a car wash. So it still looks kind of new, you know what I'm saying? It's brand new. It was like 200 miles on it when I got it. Um, but y'all see some stuff on there just know we're going to the car wash today all right but all right y'all let's get to this video dodge charger 2021 hill cat Itachi boot bag. Shout out to my nephew. Sincerely, Usagi. Keep Ace everywhere I go. Ace, so oh. Some other stuff in there, but I can't tell y'all about that. Yo, you know it's crazy when you got that red key. <laughs> we also got the sunroof. And we got our drive modes. And now it's an eco mode. Got the red button. Um, we're gonna move it to custom mode. We're gonna skip past eco mode and we're gonna use 717 horsepower, transmission and track mode, paddle shifters off. I don't really use the paddle shifters, but I might get into them. I might get into them, actually make you feel like you, you know, doing more driving. Um, traction we on street just so we on you know slide off the road you know what i'm saying we ain't really on the track then suspension we will i usually stay on street just so the car like levels out with like the roads and stuff like that and then steering i like having mine on track um because it's harder to turn i like having the stiff um the stiff steering wheel as opposed to feeling all loose it feels weird having like loose steering wheel trying to control like all this power. But yep, let's go for a little spin.
about to hit a quick zero to 60 right here. Oh, is that a police? No, I don't think so. Right, let's see. That's some type of construction people. The handling is really good too. You can see like with the wide body, the difference between a wide body and a standard body, you can actually feel that control, that stability with the bigger tires, the 305 tires, like you feel more stable on the road. Try to do another pull right here. You gonna see it's hard to like put all that power to the ground. to like a, a track someday sometime so I can show y'all like the full power of this thing because it's really hard to do that on these you know little side roads and stuff like that um but yeah and I got my homie he got a Dodge Charger we're gonna go for some rides and stuff like that so stay tuned all the muscle car fans I don't care if you got a Mustang Camaro you know what I'm saying Appreciate all y'all. And uh, yeah, we're about to head back to the crib. Let's try to get another zero to 60 real quick just to see. No cops around. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, bro. This fuck is wild. This fuck is wild. This is crazy, man. I don't think I floored it once, though, ever since we've uh, been in the car. I think I had like 70%. And it's still like, there's so much power, bro, coming out the rear uh, wheels. I don't know if y'all can see the car, like, kind of fish chilling a little slightly before it sticks to the ground. Uh, with the way that with the camera ain't gonna hold it, but it fishtails slightly. Then once it sticks to the ground, it's gone, bro. It's gone. I feel like a rocket ship. Definitely feels different if you're actually in the car as well. Got this radar detector too. It's supposed to scan if it's a police really close, or I think it's up to like three or four miles or something like that. But if they don't have their radar on, then it won't detect them. But they gotta have their radar on for it to like pick it up. But if they don't have it on, if the police don't have it on, then they really don't have no proof to know how fast you was going. You know, they just eyeballing. <laughs> they still gonna pull you over, bro. So, well, I know you was doing 130 miles per hour. I know it. All right, y'all, we back at the crib. Appreciate everybody for uh, stopping through the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, once again, shout out to my brother, Mikan. Um, dealing with COVID, fighting through that shit, that, bro. He's one of the strongest people I know. And we're gonna be back to recording videos for y'all really soon, really soon. But I love y'all, Fire Nation. Hope you have a great day. See y'all again in the next video. Peace.